Hello, my loads and ladies. I'm Pitch Dark, and welcome to my Getting to Know You video challenge. Um, this challenge was um, was given to me by Nintendo Travis Gaming, and I humbly accept the challenge. And um, yeah, so let's, let's let's just jump right into it. So the the challenge is to answer three questions. So the first question is: Name three YouTubers that inspired you. Um, the number one YouTuber that inspired me, and the reason why I even started my channel is gopher when i first discovered gopher i was playing skyrim and i wanted to mod the game and um so i started doing youtube searches and i, I found his channel and he has a series called skyrim mod sanctuary where he uh, reviews mods and he um tells you all about them and he also tells you how to install them which was pretty cool um I mean, I've installed mods in the past, but if you're kind of intimidated by it or, you know, unsure about it, his videos are great. Now, he instructs you exactly how to do it. Um, if there's a load order that you need to follow, he'll tell you, you know, what you need to look for. And um, he just has amazing content, amazing Let's Plays. He does Skyrim, Fallout. Um, he's, he did um, The Witcher 3 um there's just so many so many videos and he's just a great youtuber and uh, i just love watching his content and really that's the reason why um i actually started my channel i just love watching his videos and um thought you know what i i should try this i think i can do this the second youtuber that inspired me is cage 848 now cage 848 does amazing videos with seven days to die uh he's been doing these Man, since since the first, the game first came out, I believe he's he's one of the top uh, YouTubers. First seven days to die, learned a lot from this guy, and um, his videos are just awesome. Um, he also did uh, Imperion, which I don't think he's doing anymore, but it, that's a game I I still love to play, and it was because of him I, I bought it. I never even really heard of it until he started putting videos up on it. Um, and the Forest is another game I love to play. Yeah, he did a let's play on that as well. So. Um, great for survival games which you know i love to do so um he's definitely uh, my second choice and my third choice would be squirrel um squirrel is, is a little bit different he does um well not different he does simulation games so um i never really had an interest in um like european truck simulator or american truck simulator uh, i seen it on a steam sale and i'm like that looks kind of cool um and i started watching his videos and he makes them so much fun that I'm like I'm I'm doing this. I bought the game. I bought a steering wheel, um, and I enjoy playing it. Um, I, I I bought a head tracker too, so you can, you know, you can move your head, um, side, you know, back and forth. So you can look out your windows and your mirrors, and it's pretty pretty cool. And you know, I can I can mod it, which you know I love to do. So uh, he definitely inspired me to um, to 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 do YouTube. So the second question is three things I'm excited for. Well, definitely new games coming out. Um, uh, I am hoping and praying that a new Elder Scrolls comes out. Um, don't know if it will, but if if there's hope, I, I am holding out hope for it. Um, my second uh, game that I'm really, really hoping for coming out is uh, Bannerlord. Um, if you've watched my Mountain Blade series, um, you, you know that I, I kind of get into that game. I really love it. Um, but Bannerlord is, is something I've been waiting for a couple of years on now, and I'm hoping it's this year that it comes out. The second thing is growing my channel. I, I'm really enjoying this. I really love putting content out there, and I really love watching your content. And, you know, it, it's just been an amazing year for me. And I'm really hoping to grow. I, I, I'm hoping to get to 1,000 subscribers if possible. If not, I don't, you know, but if I can, that would be so cool. Um, and the, the last thing and the most important thing I'm really looking forward to is my, my 15th year wedding anniversary with my wife. Um, 15 years is, is really cool. I mean, we have such a great life and she's awesome. I mean, she allows me to do this stuff, you know, and, um, you know, we really, really looking forward to, um, celebrating that with her. Now, the three things I do to relax, um, well, there's gaming. As long as the game doesn't involve me throwing a controller or smashing a keyboard or, or hucking my mouse or something like that, um, pretty relaxed there. Um, 
The other thing is is just chilling out with with my wife and our dogs. Uh, we love animals, um, so we love to you know watch TV or hang out with our iPads and just you know hang out and pet the dogs and <laughs> things like that. Um, the last thing is is writing. Um, I I love to write and I, I haven't really written things in a long time, um, but like my. Um, Adventures of Sigmund Mooncalf. I kind of wrote a backstory for him. Um, and, and a lot of my characters, I try to do that. And I really enjoy um, creating, trying to create a story out of a game. So when I, I used to play City of Heroes, which is where my channel name came from, I used to write all the backstories for our characters and I friggin' loved it. Um, and I wrote a couple stories and a couple of, you know, you know I, I attempted to maybe write a novel or, or something, but... I really enjoy doing that, and um, if I can get the time to do it, you know, I, I I love to write and create something. So that's my three questions, and and now I need to throw out the challenge to five YouTubers. So I pick these based on um, if they do commentary, because there are a lot of YouTubers I watch that I I would love to know more about, but they don't do commentary, and I don't want to put them on the spot for something like this. And um, also, if if somebody already did kind of like a you know ask me question kind of video or something, um, I, I kind of um, took them off this list. So the five YouTubers I'm challenging are Smells Bad Gaming, Avid Gamer, World War Three Gaming, Xanthopus, and Wawa Tusa Tough Guy. <laughs> I think I said that name right. Very proud of myself. Uh, so that's it for my challenge. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time.